study. Now, what words do I read? That are underlined. Underlined, but not the ones you crossed out. Not the ones I crossed. What about the ones you crossed out and underlined? The Wind Bay Edge follows Rain Vermette as she makes her second feature film. The second feature film is always the hardest to make. Its purpose is to prove that the first was not a fluke. This is hard to do. We have collaborated in the past on a film called Domus and are working on the film Domus 2. The Winnipeg Edge is designed as a making of, behind the scenes kind of movie. It is to document the so-called Rain Vermat method. Rain Vermat throws formal film training out the window. She suits on 16 millimeter film and has an immersive laboratory experience, but her vision is that of a child trying to imagine how a typewriter can read. Typewriters don't read, or do they? This is not a review. It is an admission. I'm a kindred spirit. Can a film frame self-contemplate? Can a film frame exist as an excluded part of a movie? Yes. The Winnipeg Edge is an actual place. It is being on the outside. The perimeter highway makes us all prisoners of Winnipeg. There's no highway out of town. We can never leave. We are nowhere, but we know it. And from that place of nowhere, we all watched Canadian cinema die. It was eaten slowly by animation, CGI animation, and now artificial intelligence. The Winnipeg Film Group was founded by animators. Animation used to mean bring to life. Now, it means unreal. The purpose of this film project is to support Rain Vermette in her real work. Will this film see the light of day? Hopefully you'll see a darkened theater. The end.